All right, Ryan, so here at the Draft Combine, tell us what this experience has been like. You know, it's been, it's been a great experience to, to be around some great players and obviously uh, to be fulfilling my dream, but also at the same time for me being injured, it's, uh, it's a tough situation because I really want to be out there on the floor, but you know, that's the way it goes sometimes. You make some decisions and uh, you, you go. And then the interviews is a big part of this process. What are you trying to tell the teams that uh, maybe they really didn't know about you before? No, I mean, one, that my injury isn't going to be a problem, and then obviously, uh, two, that I believe I can help their team, that I'm a winner, I have a track record of being a winner, and um, you know, I can shoot the basketball, I think most of the people know that, but also, uh, you know, I'm an improving athlete, and you know, I'm, I'm going to make a difference, I'm going to play, and I'm going to compete this level. What's your biggest misconception about you, your game? Um, I think people tend to think I'm unathletic, and that's a, that's a common theme, but uh, you know, I think I'm plenty good enough athlete. I'm not the best athlete out there, but you know, I, can, I can defend my position, and I can rebound well enough to, to play in the league, and, and then my other attributes are, are really good. What do you feel like, this is a strong center class, what separates you from the centers? And do you see yourself maybe playing some power forward in the league as well? No, I definitely think I'll be a power forward. Stretch four is what, you know, I think, uh, or I'm, I'm maybe tall enough to, to defend some of the five, but um, my ability to shoot is shoot and pass are the two abilities that um, I think set me apart, and um, you know, they, the other attributes have to come up to that level. Is there an accurate pro comparison out there or someone you try to pass the game after? You know, I, I don't think of one guy. Um, you know, I, I, there are a lot of guys that I look at and watch, from you know, Dirk to Whiskey to Brian Anderson to Paul Pierce. And all those different guys have different aspects of their game that I watch a lot of film of and, and try and learn from. But um, there's not one guy just like that.